All right, this is the shooting grinder. Uh, this is a Swiss a cylindrical grinder, a very well-made machine. Uh, we currently have it here. It's wired it for 220 volts. Now this is equipped with a live and dead uh, center spindle. Morse taper number four uh, is the main spindle, and then you can have different reduction sleeves uh, to give you a uh, three taper or a two. The tailstock is a number three Morse taper. Uh, machine is currently wired for 220 volts. Uh, we turn it on, start up our hydraulics, and we start our wheel. Don't let that fool you, that's just uh, the belt squeaking. Uh, all right, so this is fully automatic. We have a rapid approach, bringing the wheel in, and at the same time, starting our plunge feed. This will feed down to zero. You can take about 39, 40 thousandths worth of stock off of a part, and when the time is up, it will retract. We also have longitudinal grinding where we have our table going and again each time we reverse we're going to feed a little bit and it'll feed like that down to zero and then uh, when you're going to use traverse you want to select this setting so that it doesn't pop out on you in the middle it'll wait till it gets to the reversal so it's off of your part it's a mechanical variator in here these are very nice you can slow this down nice or go up a higher RPM. Um, coolant system has its own pump. It, it's just laying on the inside at the moment. And you've got different screens and different baffles in there. This also is equipped with a swing down um, ID attachment, which makes this a true uh, universal grinder. Now you can swivel the work head and you can swivel the table and you have uh, ID attachment so that's what makes this a universal ID grinder. You have a fine adjustment over here uh, for your final size and a taper adjustment for your table. So this is a nice running grinder. We can slow this right down. This is a uh, a dresser meant to dress your, that's your diamond wheel, that your diamond. Uh, you have to adjust it, make sure it's all in the right position, and then you can use that uh, to dress your grinding wheel. Now the grinding wheel on this uh, is probably about an inch and three quarters wide. I, I imagine you can put a two inch wheel on there. This is a 14 inch wheel with a five inch bore. And uh, your hydraulics are mounted inside of the grinder, kind of uh, for, hydro for thermal stability. It, the machine warms up after a while to a, a set kind of a temperature. Uh, the electrical cabinet is mounted up here where you can work on it. And um, that's about it. That's the shooting uh, model HTG 400. And all the other specifications can be gotten off of our website. Thank you very much.